Hi, everybody. Happy Thursday to you. Three new senior meteorologist Matt Wentz with a look at your forecasts. Thanks so much for joining us on our YouTube channel this afternoon. We've got temperatures today that are delightful. We're in the 70s. We've got lower humidity coming in hour by hour with a nice north breeze. Just a picture perfect afternoon, if you ask me. Tonight, going to be on the chilly side. Give the AC a break. Open up the windows. We're back into the 50s for lows. You might need a jacket out the door tomorrow morning. But my goodness, you can just shed that jacket. We're up near 80 by noon, well into the 80s tomorrow afternoon. Humidity will stay low, so uh, comfortable mid 80s. If there is such a thing, we'll have some high clouds that increase from the west tomorrow afternoon into the evening. And then you see, yep, we got some rainfall chances on our way Sunday or Saturday. So in terms of our weekend, Saturday, scattered rain and storms around. Some of those could be on the stronger side, may have some heavy rainfall with those as well. Not a washout, but we're going to need to keep our close eye on the radar throughout the day Saturday. Sunday, improving conditions may start with some morning clouds and fog. We should burn that off and give way to some sunshine across northeast Ohio. So a better day on Sunday. Humidity really ramps up. Look at this. We go from comfortable Friday to tropical on Saturday. That's out ahead of that next system and then we go back to some more comfortable air next week. Long range of forecast. This will take us through 4th of July holiday. Here are your storms on Saturday, perhaps the complex in the morning with more storms firing in the afternoon. We'll continue to fine tune the details on that. It's still too far out, believe it or not, to fine tune exactly when the storms are going to hit. So uh, we'll continue to obviously focus on that forecast. There's going to be some lingering moisture around here on Sunday. I've got us dry, but just keep in mind, man, if this system stalls a little bit slower uh, or moves a little bit slower, we may have some rain around here on Sunday. But I've got us dry for right now with more rain coming our way by next Wednesday. That's when the next front arrives. This is July 3rd. For July 4th, there'll be rain around. And notice the pattern. We stay kind of stormy for the 4th of July holiday weekend. So we're going to be dodging some storms around here. And in terms of rain, I mean, notice we're one of the wettest spots in the country. The plane's getting it as well. So a pretty stormy pattern here as we go through time. In the near term, we've got to focus on Saturday's rain. And our in-house model spitting out anywhere from 1 to 3 inches of rain on Saturday. That will change in terms of the forecast. You'll notice those numbers change, but the trend is there for some heavy rain. That's why I want to mention it now. Your Medina Country Club seven day forecast. Beautiful today. Same thing tomorrow, except except a little bit warmer. And then Saturday, there's your storms behind that front. We clear out and we do it all over again with cooler, drier air moving in here Sunday, Monday, and then next week we start to heat things up. We'll have some humidity around for 4th of July and I introduce storm chances on July 3rd. So we'll see. We got a lot to deal with here over the next week and a half in terms of forecasting. Our next update on the TV side of things coming your way at four o'clock. Enjoy your Thursday, everybody. We'll see you then.